Hey friends and welcome back to my channel. This video is all about fixing this particular issue. Windows cannot be installed to this hard disk space. Windows must be installed to a partition formatted as NTFS. So without wasting time, let's go ahead and directly proceed with the resolution. First of all, let me make you one thing very clear that by doing these steps, there will be a loss of data in your hard disk. So make sure if your data is important, do a backup of your data and then proceed with the steps as shown in this video. Now the basic and easy method to fix out this issue, simply select each of the partition one by one and click on the option delete. You need to delete all the partition one by one so that the last partition that is left is unallocated space. After doing so, click on the option new. Now from here, you need to create a drive to install the windows. I will go ahead and create a space for a hard drive and hit the option OK. After creating this particular hard drive space, simply click on the next button and this will completely fix out your issue. After installing windows, you can create another drive using this unallocated space. Now if this method failed to work out, you need to first of all close the setup. Now at this point of time, you need to press shift plus F10 key. Now type here disk part and hit enter key. Now type list disk and hit enter key again. Now one more thing friends, make sure while installing the windows, you unplug all the external hard drive, SSD or any kind of USB drive so that you will not format or accidentally lose the data from that particular drive. Now after unplugging all the drives, the only disk which is visible is disk 0. So type in select disk 0 and disk 0 is the disk in which you are going to install the windows. Now type here list partition and hit the enter key. Now out of the available partitions, you need to select the partition where you would like to install the windows. I want to in install the windows on partition 2. So I'll type in select partition 2 and hit the enter key. After selecting the partition, hit clean. After that, type in convert MBR and then hit the enter key. Once the disk is successfully converted to MBR, go ahead and install your windows and again the issue will be fixed. If this also failed to work out, you need to create a new bootable USB using a Rufus. So I'll go ahead and teach you how to do that. Open up your web browser and from here scroll down and click on this Rufus portable version to download the Rufus into your PC. Once downloaded, open the exe file to run the Rufus into your PC. Now insert your pen drive and click on the option select to choose your ISO file. My ISO file is in D drive, Windows, Windows 10. Now while creating bootable USB from a partition style, you need to choose the option MBR. Then click on the option start. After creating bootable USB using the MBR partition style, reinstall your windows and this will completely fix out your issue. So that's all about it friends. If this video works out for you, I request you to please click on the subscribe button and turn on the bell notification icon to continue showing updates from my channel. Thank you so much friends. Thank you for watching.